What's going on everyone? It's Marcellus back with another video and we got to go over Shiba Inu today. So looking at the Shiba Inu chart right here is kind of doing what we predicted. It's kind of still going up here on this trend line. So what we could probably see now is an uptrend similar to this and then reaching right here and then meeting this around here and then possibly having a breakout around this area. So if we do end up having a breakout around this area with Shiba Inu, it could either go up or down, remember that. Remember, I'm not a financial advisor and this is not financial advice. We're just following the trend lines, but we're just watching where it's going. So if we're having more selling, then we're obviously going to go down. If we're having more buying, then we're going to go up. So right now we are just watching it and all we can do is watch it until it gets to the top of the trend line and continues to trade sideways because it's what it does. And you know, we just follow these things all the time and they always follow these trends so it's just best to let it do what it does and um you know let the technicals go and do themselves and yeah let them sort themselves out because we can't really do anything about it we have no power over it but shiba inu is on an uptrend that's all we need to worry about and we are set to go all the way up here this is my prediction for the short term remember 0 0.000013 is only a short term prediction so that's only a short-term prediction. So I have a long-term prediction, but right now let's look at this other stuff that we have with Shiba Inu. So we are the second most viewed crypto here on, um, you know, coin market cap here. But Jindo Inu, I don't know anything about that. A lot of people have been talking about it and I'll do some research on it, but they took us over. And then Dogecoin, obviously number three. It's like all the dog, you know, all the dog stuff is all top four. I was about to say top five, but you know, top four because Alaska Inu, I don't know anything about Alaska Inu either. But now we have an Alaska Inu. So this keeps happening. Uh, but the solid communities that we see, you know, the ones that had the actual market caps here because Coin Market Cap actually knows them and recognizes them as official. I don't know anything about the other ones, but Shiba Inu and Dogecoin are official, you know, official inside the crypto market. You know, they've been officialized. So right here, Shiba Inu, 3.8 billion in market cap. That's a lot of market cap. And 8. 898 million in 24 hour trading volume so right now i do want to do the prediction that we have for shiba inu because we have major catalysts that are just going to send shiba inu to the moon so one of the major catalysts obviously we have shiba swat that's coming out so when we do this prediction we have to take into account all of these different catalysts so shiba swap coming out is a major catalyst bone that is a major catalyst because when that comes out when shiba swap comes out that's going to be huge and remember that's why shiba swap is taking so long because leash is supposed to be you know with the um sheep is supposed to be with sheep and so this is just a lot of things are going to come out and they're going to tie leash to sheep so then you're going to be able to stake your sheep in order to get leash and i don't know how they're going to make all that work but that's going to be pretty cool when it comes out so sheba swap is a major catalyst here in leash and bone so we also have the shiba inu uh well this is their price prediction so looking at other people's price predictions other people aren't as optimistic i'm seeing because whoever made this article i've been looking at it i'm like what all right let's just look at these shiba inu price predictions they predict that by 2022 shiba inu will probably be around 0 0.00022 so cutting off one zero and then to going out to the two two area and then the three seven area i mean that is such a small price prediction like honestly we're going to get to around to point zero 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 two two around july june i mean so it's june so coming into july we're going to go up 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 and up inside price so we're going to get right back to where we were before with shiba inu because we were really high with shiba inu so do not forget about that we were all the way up here with shiba inu all the way up there at the top and we're going to get right back up there you know around june and july so we're gonna have a lot of growth it's just coming right back somewhere we fell off from and then when we finally get there we're probably gonna have a little dip and then we're gonna have a huge jump about 30 percent above it before we probably have another dip that goes back down to the three four area the three five area and possibly even two five which then leads us to go on another rampant you know up uptrend all the way up above that amount again so really shiba inu is kind of doing what dogecoin did you know with doge day 420 how everything went crazy boom blew up and then it dropped huge and then you know it kind of came right back up and that's what we're seeing we're coming right back up here with shiba inu so yeah i don't think their prediction is as good as mine my prediction is higher and um just to look at what i predicted to be at let's do some math here because we have to take in account the circulating supply that is one of the main things you have to take into account. So what you want to do, you want to take this circulating supply over here. All right, let's copy and paste this because I don't feel like typing this out. Too much to type there, too many zeros. Take that circulating supply, paste it there. 
go ahead and multiply it by whatever your target price is i would say shiba inu i keep coming back to this price right here because i do believe when dogecoin hits 129 billion dollars market cap 129 billion dollar market cap brings dogecoin to one dollar and when dogecoin reaches one dollar this is when shiba inu will reach this amount boom 98.6 billion in market cap because we are following behind dogecoin inside of a you know certain type of fashion but we are overpowering dogecoin in growth so we're slowly reaching dogecoin inside of the same pace right here leading up to uh cbe news price right here so this is really crazy because you know dogecoin will be at 129 billion market cap one dollar but cbe inu would have done more growth inside the same amount of time because CB Inu is such a cheaper coin, it'll be easier to get it to a $98 billion market cap than it is to get Dogecoin all the way up to its $129 billion market cap. That's why CB Inu has like such a good position right now. So right now, 0 0.00025 is my price prediction. So by the end of the year, we definitely will be there. And if we have this huge jump, like I'm saying, June and July, we can possibly hit it before then. But don't get your hopes up because remember where we went last time and that is probably where we're going to have another resistance so we're going to have another you know resistance line right around there that we can probably see it better here so we're going to have some more resistance when we come back all the way up here and we're going to have to break that resistance so whenever that happens you know you will notice it because it won't want to you know reach past that point and just like how i was talking about with dogecoin let me show you the uh, dogecoin chart because it'll put it into better perspective when you look at that so going over here looking at dogecoin and let's go over to their chart um the dogecoin chart right here so like the same thing that happened right back here is the same thing that could happen with shiba inu you know it jumped up huge and now we went down huge and now we're about to jump right back up huge and then once we go down huge we're going to be down for a little bit a little bit and then we're going to go up way more and then you know i feel like it's going to be that same kind of movement here for shiba inu so it's just because when you look at shiba inu it looks the exact same so let's go back over here to uh shiba inu and as you can see market cap we are lower down there but all right let's look at that shiba inu so the same thing you can say with shiba inu we hit the peak there then we went down and now possibly we can be coming right back up here and then when we come back up there we'll meet that at the resistance line and then we'll probably break it just a little bit and barely before we go down a little bit and then people start selling out and then people start having the same you know fud the fear uncertainty doubt like we're having now and people talking bad on tv inu until boom it has another breakout which sends it to our price target that i just now made right there 0 0.00025 so three zeros and two five and which will make our market cap 98.6 billion so i definitely believe cb inu can reach a 98.6 billion market cap and why do i believe that look at how many people are watching this 886,000 people like if you do the math like what if 886,000 people right just out of nowhere put 10k inside cb inu that would already be a 8.86 billion market cap now think about all the rich people that see this and they're like oh all these people just now put all their money inside shiba inu so now when they see that now they're going to put their big money we got little money but they got big money so when they put big money in it it goes and explodes that's about as simple as it can go you know as simple as it is that's how it is because they see that all the smaller people are into it they're like okay let's artificially raise this up and then it'll go all the way up until it hits a peak and then we'll do a rug pull on the little guys and that's why when you see things hit a peak just know it's going to drop just like with everything everything drops once it hits a peak and it happens almost every single time with everything nothing will continuously go up without coming down because what goes up must come down so even if it goes down even slightly a little bit it has to come down some more before it goes back up and that is why everything drops so i definitely believe that we can get a huge shiba inu army to come together and buy a lot of shiba inu just provoking the bigger whales to come inside and put more money into it and that is what we are hoping that happens here with shiba inu so shiba inu is still pumping and just watch when shiba swap comes out the opportunities are going to start showing themselves and then the people who have the real money are going to start artificially raising sheep so you want to be in before those people start artificially raising it because when they start artificially raising sheep that's when it starts to get really expensive and then you start buying at the peak and now you're buying when they're about to do their rug pull and you know they're going to do it 
and that's just how it is it's not the Shiba army doing the rug pull it's the whales it's like the whales are the ones that always sell at the peak so we have to follow them if we don't want to lose our money so that is what i'm saying people say hold 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 i say hold till you hit the peak and then sell and then buy back in at the dip that's how you do win every single time and i mean i didn't follow my instructions here and i actually held 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 and i fell all the way down there and i and i'm still holding and that's why i'm saying this because I was watching it and I knew I, I had a good amount of money. I was like, okay, if I just go ahead and sell this, that's going to be a really nice, a really, really, really nice profit. But I didn't do it. And now I have to wait for the second round. And whenever you wait for the second round, it's so terrible because if you could have just bought or if you could have just sold here and then bought back in down here, then you'd be making a whole nother round out of thin air. So that would be, that's the um, idea that you want. And that's what you want to have here with TV Inu. But yeah, this is my price prediction, 0.00025. That is three zeros and a two five. I know it's a lot, but yeah, that is where we're going to go there with Shiba Inu. But remember, I'm not a financial advisor, and this is not financial advice. So let's go ahead and look at what we have for Shiba Inu. Okay, so this is this Twitter for Shiba Inu. Let's go up here. So as you can see, Shiba Inu still trending inside some form or fashion here we need to be on the front trending page though with twitter so that is one thing that we need to see here because bitcoin is here but shiba inu is not so we need shiba inu back on the front trending page for twitter and as you know we are listed on new exchanges worldwide globally every single day there's they're just coming out with new exchanges every single day with shiba inu this one was two days ago but still almost every single day they're coming out with something new there's a bunch of these different exchanges i don't even know half of them but um every single day we're seeing new exchanges so yeah kudos to them so there's so many different things i have it on qcoin though that is if you wanted to look up qcoin qcoin is actually pretty good but um i would get it on binance but they don't have it on binance us so that is how it is over there. Let's go ahead and see how we are trending here with Shiba Inu and see if we are still trending here, at least on Google Trends, because that's really what's going to help drive the price up. As much as long as it's trending, you know it's going to drive up. Always watch the trends here. So Shiba Inu puppy, Shiba, can Shiba Inu hit one cent? Shiba Inu can hit one cent if we have uh, a huge inflation inside of a lot of different things. So let's just go ahead and look at where we would be for one cent. So if you want Shiba Inu to hit one cent, that's 3.9 trillion in market cap. It's not far fetched because there was already 1.1 trillion inside of Bitcoin. So if there was already 1.1 trillion in Bitcoin, yeah, Shiba Inu can hit one cent in theory, but it can hit one cent after it reaches, you know, five years down the line, you know, that, that type of stuff. Five years down the line, we can definitely see something like this. Five to 10 years. I'm saying it, that something like that can happen. Definitely. Now Shiba Inu to $1. It could happen. I mean, it, anything could happen. But I mean, three hundred and ninety-four trillion dollar market cap. Shiba Inu probably won't reach one dollar unless every single Shiba Inu, but like a million, was burned. So that would that would be like the one-time scenario. Like every single Shiba Inu, but one million Shiba Inu or something like that was burned. And that's pretty much my price prediction here with Shiba Inu. So the last thing we need to discuss with Shiba Inu is the petition for Robinhood because this is the major catalyst that could send Shiba Inu to the moon. It's the main thing that could send us just going, you know, skyrocketing to that $98 billion market cap that we need to get to. Remember, $98 billion market cap brings us to 0 0.00025. And that's exactly where we want to reach with Shiba Inu. This is a realistic, this is a realistic prediction and you know it's about as realistic as it gets and you know a lot of people have been telling me you know one cent isn't realistic 3.9 trillion dollar market cap isn't realistic one cent is not realistic so okay i'm going to do another prediction here 0 0.00025 you all better be satisfied with this prediction because i know there was some people that are saying that one cent is not achievable which is 3.9 trillion dollar market cap which over time i know that is achievable but i guess we'll just keep that for the overtime one but for more short term preferences, this is what we can see 0 0.00025. So this is a short term, you know, prediction short term as in, you know, maybe two weeks, no, not two weeks, not two weeks, you know, like a month or two, like June, July, right? June, July. If we don't see this price here, then by the end of the year, we have to see this price. It has to, because if it doesn't, that means Shiba Inu failed. So we will definitely see this price by the end of the year. So this is just my prediction. Remember, I'm not a financial advisor. It's not financial advice. 
but yeah this robin hood petition is going to be the main thing that you know sends us to the moon we really need to get on robin hood and as we can see we have 92,000 people who signed up for this petition and robin hood has already addressed this petition here they've ad they addressed it but they haven't said that they're going to actually put it on uh robin hood so right now it's a rumor but remember what they say buy the rumor sell the news so we know right now that this is a rumor so we need to buy this and if robin hood just came out and they said on this day shiba inu will be released you know people will probably buy in on that day and make it go up huge but then they'll sell really quick you know just to get their money because they know it only went up because what happened so what is most likely going to happen with shiba inu robin hood is just going to drop it without saying anything they're just going to drop shiba inu and just they're just going to let it flow you know because they know that is exactly how they can send the price going up and they're probably going to buy in on some shiba inu tokens before they do that you know they're going to do it and if they don't make the wallets a thing before they do that that means that we also don't have control of the wallets which means there's going to be a huge pump in shiba inu going leading into robin hood going into there so not only is it going to jump when robin hood releases shiba inu there's going to be a jump before that prior to it because they have to buy in the tokens so then people can buy it from them so that's something you have to think about with Robinhood and Shiba Inu. There's going to be two jumps. So buy the rumor, sell the sell the news. Right now, it is a rumor. So we're going to have a jump right now before the rumor, you know, really sets in. And people are like, okay, it's news now. Robinhood says they're going to release it on this day. And that's when, all right, we're going to have this huge jump. And then when we actually have that jump, it'll look something similar to this. We're going to have another dip. And they're going to be like, oh, man, we, we knew this was going to happen, blah, blah, blah. But yeah, that's what's going to happen pretty much. But yeah, remember, I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. This is just my little prediction here with CBNU. But if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button, subscribe, and check out the link in the description for a free stock with Robinhood and Weeble. And I'll be back with another video.